Here we go then, the green flag goes down onto the ninth final. Four of the best of four one soft cars as they go off into action for 20 laps at the Stadium. Oh, Willie Scores Jr. a bit snaky as he comes down the home straight and spins out into the market fires. Oh, Willie Scores Jr. goes out on the pitch turn. The Red Raiders charge their way around the roadway bend. Problems for 278 goes spinning around on the inside of the pitch turn. As they race on through, he backs up out of the way towards the inside of the turn. Now rejoins the race in the back of the grid. 348 leads us away, problems on the back straight. Oh, red flag, red flag, big crack down the home straight. Big crash. Green flag goes down, we're back and racing once again. 3 4 8 leads us away. On the restart as we get back underway. Tightly packed grid as they go down the back straight into the roadway bend. 2 6 8 takes up the lead, they come round the roadway bend down the home straight. And into the pit turn, very close, and it's 2 1 5 of Jeff Nichols. And Nigel Green is involved as well. 335 has been spun around down on the pitch turn as well for Mark Woodhull. Jeff Nichols is now spun out on the roadway bend down on turns three and four. Pumps for 55. Oh, Craig Finnegan as he uh, gets himself going once again. Nigel Green has truly immobilised down on the roadway bend with a puncture. Treble five of Frankie Raymond Jr. Jr. And Cleo 2 has gone onto the infield on the back straight. There's a race on through. on down on the home straight here and it's Daniel Johnson that takes it up from 22. Willie Scores Jr has gone around on the inside of the pit stand as well. But it's four that leads as they go through. Around the roadway bit to peel off another lap as they come past the terrible home straight. 5 4 one looking to redo it down on the pit stand just as the leaders come past him. Daniel Johnson then as he goes down the back straight. 22 chasing him down. Will the arrow and after that. Please, Alex, halfway next time. Number 422, 166, 150, Nick Sauter. Jeff Nichols is back out, but having a real rough ride of it in this one. So 166 with the saying he may well be a lap down, but confirm that. 166 is a lap down, so what the Nick Sauter is there in... Uh, Fourth place as the leaders come through once again. Number four from 22 and 153rd, Mick Spooner. So as they go down the back straight, Bobby Griffin lap down as they go through. Formula 1 stop cars is number four, Dan Johnson makes his way to the pit turn. Head of the rest as they battle their way through, more problems with a puncher. But Craig Finnegan in 55, he's gone with one lap to go. As they go through, two laps to go, it's time for Dan Johnson as he comes through. 
the ball pumps ahead of him. 220's gone around as they come out of the pit turn. They've got the car right across the middle of the track for 220. William Hunter, previous race winner. He then gets himself fired up and out of the way as Jeff Nichols clears away. On to the final lap now for number four, Daniel Johnson, as he goes down the back straight for the final time in tonight's final. The Brisker 4 1 stop cars, check a flag to race. Here he is, it's number four, Daniel Johnson. Comes through to take the win in tonight's final. For the risk of Formula 1 stock cars, the rest come through to complete the distance. And the red flags are out, red flags are on the raceway to win tonight's final for the Brisker Formula 1 stock cars. Great presentation to come in a few moments. In amongst the big stars of the big league in the Brisker Formula One stock cars. Of course, don't forget, it's some way off. It's a long way off. But the Formula One stock cars are back here for a shootout round at the end of October. But winning it, if they can get the beast fired up again, Dan Johnson, here they come on their lap of honour. 